Neil deGrasse Tyson has finally broken his silence. Betelgeuse, the massive red supergiant star, is on the brink of explosion, set to take over the night sky in a spectacle that could change the course of human history. Some scientists even believe the explosion has already happened, potentially threatening Earth's stability and marking the dawn of a new era. But what evidence did scientists uncover? How bright would Betelgeuse shine in our sky if it explodes, and could this event spell doom for our planet? Stay tuned as we explore these questions and more. For centuries, Betelgeuse has captivated observers from Earth, a brilliant red jewel in the constellation of Orion. Its mesmerizing glow has led to countless myths and scientific inquiries. But now, the star that once sparked wonder is at the center of a scientific debate that could have profound implications for our future. Betelgeuse is a red supergiant, one of the most luminous stars visible to the naked eye, and recent observations suggest it might be on the verge of a spectacular supernova. In today's video, we'll dive deep into the evidence, the potential impact on our planet, and what this could mean for humanity. Betelgeuse, the tenth brightest star in the night sky, is not just any star. Located in the constellation Orion, it's the star that marks the hunter's shoulder, shining with a reddish-orange hue. This giant of a star is also part of the Winter Triangle Asterism and the center of the Winter Hexagon, making it a familiar sight to stargazers around the world. Visible from nearly every inhabited region except Antarctica, Betelgeuse rises in the east just after sunset from mid-September to mid-March, dominating the winter night sky. Despite its visibility, Betelgeuse is shrouded in mystery. One of its most intriguing features is its variability in brightness, a phenomenon that has puzzled scientists for as long as they've been studying the stars. But what makes Betelgeuse so fascinating is not just its size, if it were to replace our sun, it would extend out to the asteroid belt, but also its youth. At only 8 to 10 million years old, Betelgeuse is relatively young compared to our 4.6 billion year old sun. Yet, despite its youth, it's nearing the end of its life, and that's where things get interesting. Betelgeuse is a supergiant, burning through its nuclear fuel at a rapid pace. Stars like Betelgeuse don't live long lives, they evolve quickly and end in a spectacular explosion, a supernova. Historical records suggest that Betelgeuse's evolution has occurred within the span of human history, making it a prime candidate for the next supernova event we could witness. To understand how scientists have come to the conclusion that Betelgeuse might be on the brink of explosion, we have to look back at the evidence. The story begins in the 2nd century BC when Chinese astronomers first observed Betelgeuse and described it as a yellow star. By the 2nd century AD, the Greco-Roman astronomer Ptolemy described it as reddish-orange, a color that remains consistent today. This change in color might indicate that Betelgeuse has evolved from a yellow supergiant to the red supergiant we see today, a sign of its aging process. But it's Betelgeuse's variability in brightness that has really caught the attention of scientists. In December 2019, Betelgeuse's brightness suddenly dropped, alarming astronomers around the world. The star, once among the top 10 brightest in the sky, had dimmed so much that it fell out of the top 20. This sparked speculation that Betelgeuse might be preparing for a supernova. Fortunately, by early 2020, the star's brightness began to return to normal levels, but the event left scientists with more questions than answers. Further investigation using the Hubble Space Telescope revealed that Betelgeuse had expelled a vast amount of hot material into space creating a massive dust cloud that blocked a significant portion of its light from our view. This dust cloud explained the sudden dimming, but it also suggested that Betelgeuse was undergoing significant changes beneath its surface. Now, in a twist that has scientists even more puzzled, Betelgeuse's brightness has not only recovered but has exceeded its usual levels. The star's luminosity has surged by over 50%, leaving astronomers scrambling to understand what's happening. Some believe that the star's earlier dimming and subsequent brightening might be linked, that the material ejected in 2019 disrupted the star's plasma flow, leading to the current increase in brightness. But there's another, more concerning possibility. Some scientists propose that Betelgeuse might be entering the final stages of its life, approaching the supernova phase. If true, this would be one of the most significant astronomical events in recent history. A supernova occurs when a massive star like Betelgeuse exhausts its nuclear fuel, leading to a catastrophic explosion. 
The energy released in such an event is unimaginable, comparable to the sun's output over its entire lifetime. If Betelgeuse were to explode today, the impact on Earth could be significant. The explosion would release a massive amount of radiation, including gamma rays, X-rays, and cosmic rays. While Earth's atmosphere would protect us from most of this radiation, there could still be consequences. Radiation could damage DNA and cellular structures, potentially leading to an increase in cancer rates and other health issues. But scientists reassure us that the chances of this radiation reaching Earth are low, and our atmosphere is well equipped to shield us from any harmful effects. But what if Betelgeuse has already exploded? Recent research by Hideyuki Sayo and colleagues at Tohoku University in Japan suggests that this might be the case. They found evidence that Betelgeuse could have already undergone a supernova, and we're just waiting for the light of that explosion to reach us, a journey that could take another decade or more. If true, we're on the brink of witnessing a cosmic event that could change the way we understand the universe. But what would it look like if Betelgeuse did explode? First, it would be an incredible sight, so bright that it would be visible even during the day, casting shadows at night. But while it would dominate the night sky, it wouldn't outshine the moon, which would still be the brightest object in the sky. Over time, Betelgeuse would gradually fade, leaving behind a beautiful nebula where the star once shone. While the supernova itself wouldn't pose a direct threat to Earth, it could have indirect effects on other forms of life. Some animals rely on moonlight for navigation, and the additional brightness from the supernova could disrupt their behavior. Additionally, astronomers would face challenges in observing other celestial objects, as the supernova's brightness would make it difficult to study anything else in the night sky. Despite the excitement surrounding the potential for Betelgeuse to go supernova, there's one tool we won't be able to use to observe it, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. Betelgeuse is simply too bright for the JWST, which was designed to detect incredibly faint objects. Pointing the JWST at Betelgeuse would overwhelm its sensors, like trying to look directly at the sun without sunglasses. Instead, astronomers will rely on other observatories to watch Betelgeuse closely. And while we can't predict exactly when Betelgeuse will explode, the evidence suggests that it could happen soon, or it might have already happened, and we're just waiting to see it. So, as we look up at the night sky, we might be on the cusp of witnessing one of the most spectacular events in the universe, the explosion of a star that has fascinated humanity for centuries. Whether Betelgeuse goes supernova tomorrow or in a thousand years, one thing is certain, when it happens, it will be a sight to behold. Until then, we'll keep watching, waiting, and marveling at the mysteries of the cosmos. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated on all things astronomical. Thanks for watching, and keep looking up.